क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोज फ्रॉम इकिडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द सर्किट डायग्राम ऑफ करंट शंट निगेटिव फीडबैक सो इन दिस डायग्राम सप्लाय वोल्टेज वी एस इज गिवन टू द फर्स्ट ट्रांजिस्टर here we are using two transistors that is q1 and q2 vs is applied through rs to the transistor q1 dc supply is given through resistor rc1 and rc2 to both the transistors and the output of first transistor is directly given to the second transistor the total output voltage of this circuit is taken across the second transistor's collector terminal here the voltage drop across the re of second transistor is connected through rf to the input of the first amplifier that is q1 so this voltage is basically a feedback voltage now we will find out this is which type of sampling network whether it is voltage sampling or current sampling now the output voltage is taken across the collector terminal where the feedback voltage is taken across the re so i can say that vf that is feedback voltage is nothing but the voltage drop across the resistor re as it is voltage drop it is i into r so it is i e into r e and i e is the emitter current flowing through the resistor r e as we know that the value of i e in case of transistor is always approximately equal to i c and i c is the current which is flowing through the output terminal so ic is we can say that it is a output current and vf is equal to ie into re which we can write it as ic into re in case of ie we have written it is ic so vf that is feedback voltage depends upon the output current so if the value of ic is zero then the feedback voltage is zero so this sampling is basically a current sampling in this case if vo is zero it doesn't have any effect on the value of vf so if the value of ic changes the value of feedback voltage also changes hence this sampling is not voltage but it is current sampling as we are taking the part of the output current because this feedback voltage depends upon the output current this sampling is current sampling then we will discuss about this is which type of mixing from here we are giving the feedback to the input and here we can say that the current is gets divided at this point the current going to the transistor is ii and current going to the feedback is if so as the current split into two parts this mixing is shunt mixing as the current is or source current is divided into the current going to the amplifier network and going to the feedback network hence this mixing is a shunt mixing and because of that the name of this amplifier is current shunt negative feedback so this current indicates it is a sampling network current sampling feedback voltage depends upon the current as the input current divided into two parts it is a shunt mixing network 
and the input and the feedback both are in series opposition and the input and the feedback are out of phase hence this feedback is negative feedback so this is all about current shunt negative feedback thank you for watching this video stay tuned with ekeda and subscribe to ekeda